what's going on guys, FIFA Gamer here, back with another video and today I wanted to show you my collection of Formula 1 games so I'm going to start off with my first one I got it was F1 Championship Edition for the Playstation 3 and this was quality this was quality, this was very 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 so it's a quality game. On the back you can see we have the uh, um, what the game looks like. Um, yeah, that's F1 2006. The next one was one I got from... It's F1 2009. I always thought this game it was one of the worst games, first game by Codemasters. And I'm just like, hmm, this game by Codemasters is okay. But wait till we get on to older games. Might be doing some gaming tomorrow. I don't know if it's tomorrow, but it will be coming on the channel soon. Um, might change it to gaming actually, yeah. So that was 2009. On the back we have some gameplay. Um, so that one was that one. Then we move on to realistic F1 2010 for the PlayStation 3. And I've done a career mode on here as the Virgin Team. Mana, uh, it was Mauricio basically, Mana. And I was doing okay. I got, I think I got some points, I'm not sure. But yeah, anyway, on the back we have what is in that game. Um, yeah. So that's F1 2010. I always thought that was a, uh, I always thought that was a good, uh, A good, oh, let me think, good game, but I'm also, and then next up we have F1 2011 for the Xbox 360. Um, I don't really play F1 2011 anymore, but I'm just getting, um, just getting these ready to show you. Um, so that. That there, that's 2011, and then on the back, that's not that there, the official Formula One game. The best racing sim in the business. F1 2011. I thought that was that the graphics was getting much better in that game than they did in, in 2006, 2009, and 2010. I think they they improved the graphics even more to try and make it the best F1 game ever. F1 2012. I thought that this was one of the best racing games ever because of the nice quality, nice daytime sun, um, and the realistic graphics as well. It was. It was. Um, sorry if you can hear my mum. That doesn't matter. It has these on the back. Feel it. Champions mode. Young drivers test. Season challenge. And game changing dynamic weather. It's got some pictures on the back as well. So yeah. I always thought the graphics. Yeah. They've improved it. They made it more realistic than they ever have and now we move on to a game that I thought was one of the best games before the before these come out and you only got F1 I only got this a few years ago F1 2013 I was only into F1 like 2015 kind of I think yeah but then um, I started buying the games and I tried them out just like you know what they're really good F1 2013 
This game was even better than all the games we featured 2012, 2011, 2010, 2009, 2006. This one was incredible. They had classic content, they had classic cars in this. Classic cars. Which was absolutely incredible. Classic cars, as you can see on the back. We got 2013 season, multiplayer, classic content. Absolutely amazing. Peggy 3 as well. 1980s content. It was only the 1980s, so it wasn't like where you can use every classic car in the game. But then I thought the graphics of the normal 2013 season was really really good and then the classic cars incredible that graphics those graphics were incredible